How's it going everybody? My name is Mick Prosif and today I want to show you a game that I've been playing for about two weeks called Legends of Eidolon. The very first thing I wanted to show you was the fact that you can have many, many characters in this game. As you can see here, I have four after playing for only a couple weeks. I'm going to go ahead and jump on to one of my more powerful guys and see how long he has been AFK. Looks like he's level 29, he's a mage, and he is currently mining. Let's go ahead and click play and see what all he's got in the few days that I've been AFK. Looks like he's mined 1,480 iron ore. That's a lot. I got iron card and some other random jazz I'm going to claim. There's all the jazz. Let's go ahead and look at my items. So far the bag is empty. I'm going to go ahead and claim all this. Bloop. And my bag should now be full. Okay, so that's a lot of ore. Do I want any of the items on the ground? I kind of want this axe, this little axe statue. So what I'm going to do is kind of walk over here and pluck some of my items out of my bag. And then go over here and get this axe trophy. And I um, might as well get this little rune as well. That way I can upgrade my weapons. Okay, let's head on over to this portal and I'll show you the little town. This is like the little community area where we can use this chest to deposit all of our ore. As you can see here, this is my chest full of all kinds of goodies. Let's go ahead and dump that in there. Let's check on our anvil. This is another AFK thing that you can just produce tons of. Uh, these are boring bricks. I'm going to go ahead and deposit all these straight to my bank. Bloop. As you can see, I leveled up uh, my smithing level, almost level 16 now. Uh, let's see if I can buy any points. I can't. I need some slime, which I have to go kill some frogs and stuff. And uh, there's some stats on my AFK bonus for making these types of bricks. You can also make nails and thread. And then as you level up, you can produce higher and higher level things. Very neat. Very neat. And it keeps you busy. It keeps you busy. We live in a world that if you're not doing something at all times, you feel like you're just not living up to your potential and this game really really helps with that so we got these little axe statues we're going to go ahead and take those up to the statue man and see if we can turn those on let's head on up here and turn in these axe uh, statues as you can see here it boosts random stats uh, since this one is an axe this one's going to boost our lumber uh, efficiency chopping power let's see if we can get uh, that up to one Yep, 1.2. Cool. So that's now level 4. Uh, I do want to continue making more bars. So let's go ahead and take out some of the copper bars here and put in some iron. That way I can smelt, smelt, smelt. Let's go ahead and put all these bars in my little chest here. Deposit. Now you can see here I do have a ring. Since I do have some extra bag space, I think I'm going to make another ring. I'll show you guys how to do that real quick. Let's go ahead and take all of these out. And a few of these. There we go. Okay, let's go to our anvil. And we're going to produce a bronze ring. It might be a copper ring. Let's find out. Okay, produce. Craft. There we go. Scroll down. You can craft all kinds of things. I'm going to be crafting a copper band, which you can see the stats here. It gives uh, extra stats to just about everything. Uh, craft. Inventory full, of course. Of course. All right, let's deposit just this bar and make a ring. This is going to use 300 of our bars, but it also will give me quite a bit of experience for smithing. Boom, 330 XP. Now we have a copper ring that I can put into my bag and log over to my alt characters and equip that ring onto them. Let's go ahead and put the remainder of our bars into this bag or this chest and empty out this guy so that we can put loads of iron ore in here. Every character can be specialized via these talents down here. There's like a talent tree for every specific class, there's mage, warrior, I think hunter, and a few other things. And basically, whenever you click on these skills, you get skill points every time you level up. 
you can specialize in, for example, this guy can specialize in lumber. And I can go and chop down some trees. I should probably upgrade that a little bit. But uh, maybe at a different time. There's an energy bolt. Level 18. Crazy. Okay. Let's go ahead and deposit the rest of this. I want to now take out all of the iron ore. So that I can go smelt that. Let's go put that in the furnace. And deposit. There we go. There's 400 iron ore. And you'll notice a small tiny bar right here that will slowly start to fill up with red. Let's go over here and see if there's any more copper ore that I might have in my chest that I can have it smelting as well. Let's take all that out so that I'm always doing something. Always got to be doing something. All right, let's go dump those off. And deposit. There we go. So that frees up space in my chest and we'll also start cooking all of these things. I'm going to go back to uh, mining now that my bag is empty and see if there's any deals in the shop first real quick. Lots of food, lots of potions, all kinds of things. Uh, one thing that I do like to purchase if it's there is the armor upgrade. So I'm going to buy a few of those. Looks like there's six in stock. I'm going to take all of them. And let's see what else. Don't really care for much else. So let's go ahead and put those armor upgrades into our chest for our alt characters so they can be better. And pop those into the bag. And go back to farming our ore. And then go to our alt character. So that he can do the same thing. This guy's chopping birch trees. Let's go see how much wood he has. Alright, look at all that stuff. This guy was AFK for 2 days, 6 hours, and 50 minutes. And he got a lot of stuff. One thing that's cool here, the Golden Nomwich. I really want to keep that. So let's claim. I want to click the Golden Nomwich first. Boop. Uh, I'm going to equip that immediately. That's going to go right here. And that will boost my stats by all of this forever. And it's never consumed, so that's great. Uh, let's look at this guy. Hold down on this bag to increase the carrying capacity of the fallen items to 25. Log with leaves. That's great. Let's hold that down. Poof. Capacity increased. Let's go ahead and get this card first. Ooh, I got 400 bleached logs. Wow. Inventory is full. The only thing else I see here that I really want is this statue, and I probably want this rainbow thing. And uh, you just repeat. I have four characters. You can up unlock, I believe, six or more. And then just play whenever you want to play. I really enjoy this game. You get to log in just whenever. And if your character's been AFK for like two days, you just log into a load of loot, and the game continues playing without you. It's really fun. Really fun. So maybe give it a try. If you like it, let me know. And uh, feel free to like and subscribe because doing YouTube is awesome. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Stay safe.